So it's time to go, and at the very last second, the doctor's like, Dad, do you want to catch the baby? We're just your average family who is choosing to live a not-so-average life. We decided to sell everything and leave our home for an adventure around the world. And now, we are the Bucket List family. Garrett, Jessica, Dorothy, Manila, and Callie. Welcome to our family adventure. Where are we off to next? We're back. Good morning from Utah. Do your I'm a parent of three kids dance. I brag about you ooh, ooh, to anyone outside. Anyone outside. But I'm a man of the woods. It's my pride. It's my pride. <laughs> Whoa, that's a. I'm pretty proud. That's a sec pretty sexy uh, that's, father of that's, three. And man. that's how three kids were made. Flashback to the last like week or the last weeks of being okay, pregnant. Okay, no. If you've been pregnant, you know this. Pregnancy is rough, but the last month of pregnancy is no fun. It's hard. It's tiring. You're uncomfortable. You're anxious. You're excited. You're like every emotion. And most of all, you're just so, so excited. Hi, Callahan. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good job. We were really nervous this time around, though. I don't know why. I, I do know why. I felt like we had a really smooth delivery first and second child and so we were just due for some drama we're a little superstitious to go this wrong. time <sighs> excited to meet you little buddy are you gonna watch are you gonna like look or not this time do you like to look see or not really okay so garrett hates anything that has to do with blood guts and bodily functions. But I usually do well on delivery day. I yeah. like come into he like for sure steps mode. up to the plate. Except for this time, I was just so worried that something was gonna go wrong. So I was just like already was like 50% about to faint. So it's time to go. And at the very last second, the doctor's like, Dad, do you wanna catch the baby? I think we're ready. Yeah. Are you okay, okay with holding this way? Do you wanna catch? Do you wanna catch? Um, oh, I can do it. And my immediate reaction was like, no, mm -mm, nope, no thank you. <laughs> and then Jessica, she just chimes in kind of late to the conversation. It's like, come on, Garrett, step up. And I was like, no. He said, do you want to catch the baby? And then even Jessica was like, was like mm -mm, yeah, no. Nope. <laughs> no. Well, you got well, to answer. Well, it's there. You put, you're you're okay. Yeah, see if I want to catch. Oh, don't catch it. No catch. Oh, yeah. Just, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be right here. Right. Are you sure? Do you want to? I did. Then, I mean, the nurses were so nice and supportive and they knew who we are and they're like, come on, it'd be a very bucket list experience. And I'm just peer a yes pressure. man and a sucker for the peer pressure. And so I was like, put on the gloves. Sure. Do you want to? I did. If you want to, try it. would try be pretty it. cool, I okay. promise. Okay, get on me. Get up again. All right. And some gloves. Cool, Get them some like seven. So what I'll do is I'll have you kind of come in here and I'll be with you. So I'll kind of have your hands here ready to go. So he gets all like suited up and gets well, the I also, gloves on. I thought it meant like I would like catch the baby and give it to Jessica. But immediately once they get me all suited up, then the doctor explains to me, he's like, okay, so when you see the head, you're going to grab the head and you're going to pull on it. And then you're going to dip down one shoulder and then up and then onto the mom's lap. And I said, you can see me in the video say, I'm sorry, I just completely blacked out. Can you explain that again? Okay, I should oh, watch that. Say that again. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll be right here with okay. you. So I'm going to kind of help hold your hands. As the head comes out, it's kind of like a football. You're kind of grabbing like this one. Go down, come back up. And then we'll go right to the mom's A little bit. Okay. I'll help you with this. Okay. Jess, if at any time I think, you just keep going. <laughs> it's actually happened before. Yeah, yeah just like this. But I'll bet you have But not usually when the husbands are in here, I haven't had any of yeah. And she's you know not just right there. Good 
just back up and kind of slide your hand down. The head comes up. And you got it. You got it. There we go. And he came right out. Garrett put him right on top of me. And I heard a little bit of a, a squeal from him. Garrett didn't hear anything. And when he came out, he was purple. And I was just so quiet. And the doctor even asked, like, are you all right? And I was just praying and waiting and praying for any, like, cry to come out. Oh my gosh, because he was. But the just nurse is like quiet. scrubbing him, scrubbing him, scrubbing him, trying to get like the, you know, him to take his breath. And then the most special moment to a parent's ears is when you hear your baby's first cries. Oh. He's going for the nips. Oh, I found it. <laughs> special thank you to all of the nurses and the doctors and the staff at American Fork Hospital. At the end of the day, like there's so many different ways to have a baby and to go about this day, but all you want, all you want at the end of the day is a healthy baby. And we're so grateful that Callie is healthy. I'm crying. You were born to do something no one's ever done, no one's ever